can't remember off the top of my head the exact price, um, but it was actually a real bargain, um, so it's not expensive at all. Um, so if you get a chance to have a look, pop on there and have a look and see what you can find. Um, don't worry too much about these cards, I've just stuck them in there as points to talk about within the book, um, just to help me so that we don't get too held up looking through the whole thing. Um, but like I said, just cover every film, behind the scenes, all the actors, all the sets, everything. Um, and I'm just going to flip to the first point where I've marked. Let's just take that. Actually, no, I've missed. Yeah, there's a card there. I'll just move that. Um, I'm just going to flip to this page. Um, you get a little, uh, all these little pull-outs. Um, just advanced po advanced potion making, but it's actually just got things like stickers and things in, which is pretty good. Um, so you might find that pretty interesting. Um, it covers all of the different houses as well, so it's like everything. Um, just flip to the next page. Um, there's a big bit here about the Quidditch World Cup, which was featured in the Goblet of Fire. Um, it gives you just a little idea what the programme might have been like in the film, which is pretty neat. So there's that. Um, and there's a bit about the Yule Ball. I don't much know what... It's just a little thing in there just to give it something different. But there it goes on all about that, which is pretty good. Um, this is the bit, that, the main thing that I actually wanted the book for. Um, it's the Marauders map. Um, you can buy it from the Harry Potter studio tour, but I think when I went it was about 30 quid, and I think it's near enough that on Amazon. So this isn't the exact detailed copy um, that you get, but it's pretty good, and it's well worth the money. Let's just lay that down for a second and just open that up so you can see that fully out. So there we have it, that's the Marauders map. So I think if you were to spend um, the 30 quid it would be the full version. Um, but I think that was pretty neat for the money. going to cover at the beginning which also has the letter that Harry Potter got um, in the first film we'll just have a quick look at that there we go I'm sorry I'm just skimming through this but there's just so much to go through it's almost impossible to go through the whole book in detail and do it within a in a good time um, but yeah you get so much stuff in there, look if I just run through quickly to some of the pages, all these different pullouts, there's all the sets, everything that you would see um, on the Harry Potter studio tour, if you get a programme you, you know everything you get with that, um, but this just covers everything as well and it's really well worth the money, and if you know someone who's a big Harry Potter fan then this is a must, and I would re def definitely would recommend it, there you go, there's everything. well all different pullouts everything from the start to the finish um, I'm not going to go through the whole thing like I say it would just take me too long but I would say definitely go look it up buy it and just you'll love it you won't regret buying it so thanks guys all right bye